हेलो फ्रेंड्स आवर टूडेज टॉपिक इज दैट इज डायनेमिक मार्क ऑफ कंप्रेशन एक्चुअली दिस टॉपिक इज रिक्वेस्टेड ऑफ रिक्वेस्टेड बाय आवर मेनी व्यूवर्स दैट वी प्रिपेयर अ वीडियो ऑन दिस टॉपिक दैट इज डायनेमिक मार्क ऑफ कंप्रेशन एक्चुअली दिस मॉडल और यू कैन से दिस टाइप ऑफ कंप्रेशन इज टोटली डिपेंड अपॉन द कैप ऑन मॉडल इट्स टोटली डिपेंड अपॉन द कैप ऑन मॉडल और वी कैन से दिस कैप ऑन मॉडल इज स्टैटिक मार्क ऑफ मॉडल ओके दिस कैप ऑन मॉडल इज नोन एज स्टैटिक मार्क ऑफ मॉडल एंड दिस डायनेमिक मार्क ऑफ कंप्रेशन मॉडल डिपेंड्स अपॉन दिस कैप ऑन मॉडल अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस स्टैटिक मार्क ऑफ मॉडल द प्रोबिलिटी द प्रोबिलिटी ऑफ द नेक्स्ट सिंबल the probability of the next symbol being encoded being encoded depend only depend only the value of the current symbol depend only the value of the current symbol okay but it is well known that that the value or uh, that value that the next symbol takes depend not only the current symbol value but also on the past sim value as well okay uh, first we take uh, one example of uh, static marco model okay and then we take the same example for describing the dynamic mark of compression okay so uh, consider uh, we take a example of uh, a binary image having a pixel having a two pixel that is white pixel and a Uh, black pixel so if i consider a uh, two state model for a binary sequence then if this state represent the state of a white pixel and the one state represent the state of the black pixel as w and as b now if the current symbol if the current symbol or current pixel is white and the next symbol is will be white then we can shown like this probability of w by w or you can say this is the having a probability that the current pixel uh, that the next pixel is also white if the uh, current pixel is white and the next pixel will be uh, black then we can shown by a probability like this that the probability b by w this means the probability shown that the next pixel is black now if the current pixel is black and the next uh, pixel will be black then we can show like this that the probability b by b this is known as the black uh, that the current value is black and the next uh, pixel is also black and then if we have a current pixel is black and the next pixel will be white then we can show by p w by b will be like white pixel so this is how the static marco model works that the probability of the next symbol being encoded depend only the value of the current symbol and uh we take this example of a binary sequence now uh use of this capon model or static marco model or uh, how we how the dynamic mark of compression enhance this model we take it, we take the that model or we take the that compression okay so according to the dynamic mark of compression dynamic mark of compression okay which is uh, given by cormark and horspool it generalizes that this capon model which we discussed discussed it earlier it generalizes this model and in order to take the advantage of relationship and correlation that extended beyond a single symbol okay now we take the same example of a binary sequence and then we take that and uh, discuss that how this dynamic mark of compression make use of this capon model and generalize it now uh, suppose if we have a same example that we have a state of a uh, white pixel and we have a state of black pixel okay now uh, the fact that that we have two different set of probability is reflected in a two state model as we discussed it earlier now if we consider a state as w and the probability of the next value being white changes depend on whether we reach this state from this from this state either we reach this state from this state or by this state itself so we can have the model reflected by cloning this state that is sw by making a 
or by uh, cloning the state by sw dash okay now uh, if we see a white pixel after a long run first uh, i prepared this uh, model with the three state model obtained by cloning like uh, in the same way that if the system if the pixel is uh, current pixel is white and the next pixel will be white we can shown by white itself if the current pixel is black and the next pixel will be black we can shown by black itself okay or if uh, the current pixel is white and the next pixel will be black we shown like this okay and uh, if the current pixel up uh, now if uh, if we see a white pixel after a long run of black pixel then we go to the state that is called sw state which is a cloning of sw now the probability that the next value will be white is very high in this state itself so we shown like this we can like prepare like make this model like this black here we have white okay and we have a black so this this model represent i repeat it again this model represent that if we see or if we want to see a white pixel if we want to see a white pixel uh, after a long run of after a long run of black pixel okay if we want to see the white pixel after a long run of black pixel then we go to the state cloning state that is sw dash okay where <clears throat> where the probability of where the probability of next value probability of next value will be black will be white is very high is very high so this way when we estimate the probability of the next Uh, pixel value we take into account not only the current on not only the value of the current pixel but also the value of the previous pixel also which is the working of the dynamic markov compression so this process can be continued as long as we wish to take into account longer and longer history or as long as we wish is a rather statement when it comes to implementing the algorithm so this is how we describe the dynamic markov compression which is totally depend upon the capon model which is also called a static markov model and uh, in this capon model we take a two state model for a binary sequence and with the help of this model we prepare this dynamic markov compression which says that that the next value will be white or black it totally depend not only on the current pixel but is also depend the value of the previous symbol okay so this is how uh, we uh, discuss or we explain the dynamic markov compression i hope you understand this but uh, if you still have any doubt then you can ask in our comment section or uh, if you like our video then please subscribe our channel and share to your friends and to your classmates thanks for watching